Hello, and in this tutorial, similar to my other tutorial that's going to be uploaded with this tutorial, I am going to show you guys how to install PHPBB um, form script. It's a form script for um, forms, obviously, <laughs> um, for your website. Um, it's free, just like SMF. If you guys haven't checked that one out, you should check it out, compare the two, and see which one you like better. So just do a Google search for PHPBB, click the first one. I think I might be doing most of my tutorials later on with um, Chrome just because it's kind of faster for browsing while doing videos. Um, and then you just want to go to downloads and then latest version. And then you're going to want to click install PHPBB, PHPBB, yeah, tongue twister. Anyways, quick install. Bu -bu 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 Wow, they've added a lot since I've installed it. Um, hmm, where is the download file? I just want to download it. Here, just go to the latest version. And then you're going to want to go to download stable release. And hit download stable release slash whatever. Alright, <laughs> so select... Um, no not update select version blah 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 right here and then you're gonna wanna go down to the zip file and then you're gonna hit save file and then we're gonna close that I say and then a lot right click it and drag that file over here now some of the downfalls about ph PBB is that it's 2.3 megabytes and that may take a while for um, some web hosting companies depending on who you're with to upload um, if you want to do it fast do it via to an FTP connection with FileZilla that's the fastest way to upload files to your web host um, so now you're gonna uh, um, locate your web hosting web directory where you're gonna put this file so I'm gonna go to my location that I want to install this script to delete that from the previous tutorial and now I'm just gonna simply drag this file over here to my web directory um, and this web directory is localhost um, so if you were uploading this um, remotely to your web host which most of you are I bet you're gonna wanna connect to your um, your account here and then after you've connected um, you're gonna wanna locate your um, website and then you wanna drag that um, phpbb file over into it and it'll up upload it so extract your file into your web host and it's in a subfolder so just copy all this stuff and paste it it's actually 8 megabytes when uncompressed Alright, so you have all your files here. So let's open up our browser. I'm going to be using Chrome because it's faster. No, actually, I can't use it because Chrome doesn't understand localhost. So I'm going to be using Firefox. <laughs> yeah. Chrome has its downfalls. Alright, so navigate over to your website's address. In my case, it's localhost. and it should bring you up to your installation directory forward slash index.php file so this is just the introduction if you want to read it go ahead when you're ready hit install proceed to next step and it's going to do a check to make sure everything's available I don't have some things unavailable so that's bad but because this is for demonstration purposes it doesn't really matter for me it does matter for you so make sure you have this stuff actually you don't need that 
you don't need that and you don't need that you do need this I think and you don't need that anyways hit start install database server slash host name um, this will generally always be localhost database server port um, you should just leave this blank unless your host specifies otherwise database name I'm gonna actually create a new database um, if you don't know how to create a new database um, under your websites control panel in your hosting find your PHP my admin panel and create a new one and if you can't find it then contact your web host and ask them so I'm just gonna name this PHP BB under dash form I'm gonna hit create and let's say you didn't have a user you can go over to privileges and you can create a new user by clicking add a new user and follow the steps alright and then you're just gonna give the database name I did phpbb under dash form database username this is a username that corresponds to it James and from the previous tutorial our password was um, 123456m so let's hit proceed to next step successful to connection that's a good thing hit proceed to next step administrator username this is for our board to log in and moderate stuff admin mm, let's just give it a password um, confirm the password give your um, contact email address for your um, form members to contact you with alright it passed the test proceed to next step alright that's good proceed to the next step alright email settings if you have a SMTP account then you can specify all that information here um, I don't have that running on my local host so I'm just gonna skip that server URL settings um, cookie secure enable for server URL settings if set to yes the server settings will define here will be blah 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 um, yeah just select no you don't want that server protocol make sure it's HTTP colon forward slash forward slash unless you're running this on an HTTPS which is a secure connection server port just leave it as 80 script path like that so hit proceed to next step and hit it again the tables have been um, installed correctly and hit login now alright so I'm in the administration um, control panel here see and here I can pretty much do anything I want if I want to view the board like how it all looks this is how it looks. Um, if I wanted to edit my domain name here, I could go into this right here. And I could go into board settings. And then I could change this to whatever I felt like naming my website. I could give some text here. And I could hit submit. And then I could go to board index again. And as you can see, it's changed. I could change my logo. Um, by going to something I forgot <laughs> um, let's see I think styles and then image sets and then yeah you would actually just change your images right here and get over to it actually now that I'm here make sure you delete your install directory um, php.bb does not do that for you so go to styles and then go to your um, set you're using I'm using pro silver so I'm gonna select this folder image set and then I'm gonna find the logo in here here it is so I just edit this um, with the uh, image editor and 
then that image would be changed. So thanks for watching this tutorial by Animation Shorts One. Make sure to cr check out createwebsite.cc for more tutorials on website development, and I'll see you next time.